Monica has borrowed money from Alex and now she wants to repay her debt. Hi Lex, here's the money I owe you. $100 plus the 210 in interest, you loan shark. 310, ka-ching. Dear sister, I do believe the amount is somewhat higher. Say what? You owe me $808. And since I know you're poor, I've rounded down to the dollar. How do you reach that crazy number, Alex? You know, I did calculate the interest. So did I. The only difference is that I know how to calculate it correctly. But how did you reach your result? Look, I borrowed the money seven months ago. That's 210 days. We agreed on an interest of 1% per day. So that's 210% on 210 days. So I should pay you $100 plus 210% of $100. That gives a total of $310. No, sis, you're totally wrong. The interest accumulates every day. The contract says so. This means that the amount you owe me increases by 1% every day. Let me show you. I'll just draw a table. All right, so you borrowed money for 210 days. On the first day, your debt increased by 1%. So by the end of that day, you owed me 101% of the $100. That's $100 times 1.01 .01 or $101. On the second day, your debt increased by another percent. So by the end of that day, you owed me 101% of what you owed me before. Before the second day, you owed me 100 times 1.01, .01, i.e. $101. So after the second day, your debt will be 100 times 1.01 .01 times 1.01. .01. So by the end of the second day, you owed me $102.1 dollars, and so on. But Alex, that's only one cent more than my result. You said $808. Are you sure you haven't made a mistake somewhere? Yup. If you go on with these calculations, the difference will eventually be huge. Look. On the third day, you owed me 100 times 1.01 .01 times 1.01 .01 times 1.01. .01. Do you see the pattern? On the second day, you owed me 100 times 1.01 .01 squared, because this part is 1.01 .01 to the power of 2. On the third day, you owed me 100 times 1.01 .01 cubed, because this part is 1.01 .01 to the power of 3. On the nth day, you owed me $100 times 1.01 .01 to the power of n. So what do you owe me after 210 days? Those stupid $100 multiplied by 1.01 .01 to the power of 210. Calculator. Okay. Hmm. You're right, brother. Check out the equation, sister. This is the one you should have used. Ugh. Alex, you're always so wily. So, k equals k minus 0 times 1 plus x to the power of n. k minus 0 is the amount I borrowed from you, that is $100. I multiply this with 1 plus x to the power of n. 
n is the number of interest periods. Since I pay 1% interest per day, there are 210 interest periods. For every interest period, I pay an interest of 1%. So, x is 0 0.01. That's 1% in decimal form. So, once more, the equation is that I owe you $100 multiplied by 1.01 .01 to the power of 210. You're an artful dodger, brother. Like a robot, aren't you? No feelings. And you're just a spoiled brat. You just borrow the money from Dad anyway, and you're probably never going to repay them, so don't complain. Well, you're right, Lex, but don't tell them. You're shameless. <laughs> <laughs> you too. <laughs> Maybe you've learned something about interest by now or about dodgy loan sharks and spoiled girls.